Tannis Corley Leonardi trying to be money wise over here. October 2023, $900 dollar withdrawal from my retirement account and some of the other numbers. Some of the other numbers. That's what this video is about. So on the weekend of the 14th and 15th of October 2023, I submitted a request to withdraw $900 from my retirement account. I'm not going to provide all of the details of the retirement account or who it's with, even though I've brought that up on this channel, just for privacy reasons, um, kind of protecting myself. So, uh, the, um, so I, there were two forms of requ request, so that it, it's not gonna be everything, but I'll give you some of the numbers and stuff. And there were two ways I could do a partial withdrawal of re my retirement account. There was, I could ask for an amount in, pocket or I could ask for a set withdrawal amount and so essentially in pocket means additional money would be withdrawn for taxes and then later a penalty um and then but if it, and then there would be a certain amount that went in pocket a withdrawal amount is withdraw this much and then take the taxes out and whatever's left over goes to the person so I went with the $900 in pocket and so what ended up happening was there was, in addition to the $900, there was the minimum uh, taxes taken out is 20%. So that was $225. So brought it up to $1,125. And they also, <laughs> they also took out money for fees, uh, which was when I was submitting it, I didn't know that. I, I this had like withdrawal in pocket amount, taxes, and then a 10% penalty. So there was also fees taken out. And so that was $31.50. They have not deducted the 10% penalty. It sounds like that since that wasn't taken out with taxes here, I'm guessing that means like taxes, taxes at the end of the year kind of thing. Um, and the number to remember for that. So some of the other numbers, uh, 50, uh, the 10% penalty is for not being 59.5 years of age or older at the time of withdrawal. So I was approximately 31 years old at the time of withdrawal. So I do have to pay the penalty. Okay. Um, kind of thing. And then let's see. So that was, that's, those are the, kind of the numbers I'm sharing and then, or the numbers I am sharing. And I also, so I submitted the request on the weekend of the 14th slash 15th, October, 2023. Then I received an email saying my submission had been processed on the morning of Tuesday, 17 October, 2023. I received, that was yesterday. Today is Wednesday, 18 October, 2023. Then after, or approximately the same amount of time, I received an email uh, saying my withdrawal request had been approved uh, and that was on the morning of Tuesday 17 October 2023 and the delivery time of the funds was today the morning of Wednesday 18 October 2023 and when I first submitted my submission the estimated day of delivery via direct deposit for the $900 was Wednesday, 18 October, 2023. So they were on time. It got deposited today. So in that sense, um, it was timely. It was efficient. There was good communication. I received um, status updates all throughout for each step, including when the funds were delivered, I have set up so I get notified if the money is added or withdrawn to my bank accounts of a certain amount, I get an email or, or greater. And so I got an email saying the funds had been delivered and I logged in to make sure it was also. And I also logged in once the uh, withdrawal request had been approved um, and processed, but like both I got email notification about both. I went back into my retirement account and saw that, okay, in addition to the withdrawal amount and the taxes, there was also fees taken out. So I did check both financial financial institutions of the uh, retirement account and then where the money was transferred into um, one of my bank accounts. I did check both institutions once I received communications for them to verify that that in fact had happened. It had. So there we go. I said I would uh, provide <laughs> uh, or do a video um, 
if I or if, if slash when I got the money and um I was like but if it's deposited on Thursday I might not do it Thursday but it got deposited on time so I'm um, okay I'll get it done before I go out to Oregon so those videos for that trip will be financed with money um from the retirement account and um, so I already fueled up this morning it was what uh and for the trip so if you want that number it's $37.63. It was 7.744 gallons. And then I bought a quart of oil for my car. So those already are taken out of the amount. Um, but yeah, so I and I added the $500 to my sweet and or savory eats video fund, which includes gas fueling. And I'm actually going to throw oil in there because oil is not something I don't do so much driving that I need to buy oil all the time kind of thing. But I do need to buy it because uh, I do drive. Um, at least currently I dread, I'm doing some longer adventures. Okay, so there's that. So this one is going to link in the video description to my playlist for navigating my retirement account because this is my first withdrawal of funds. Um, so I guess first funds withdrawal uh, for my retirement account. So I thought I'd share because I just didn't know. Um, and then there is... I'll link to my video, uh, to my playlist with my videos covering my day trip to Oregon, for, um, which is all set and ready to go for tomorrow, Thursday, 19 October, 2023. Uh, also my squirrels, I went to cut squirrel dinner and one of the squirrels is like wishing me luck tomorrow. They brought me this rock. I've trained them well in rocks. They actually will pick up rocks and bring them to me and put them down or run past with a rock in their mouth or sniff the rocks that we put on the railing and stuff like that. Which I think I got one of those with Timber doing that <laughs> on the railing one time. Um, but yeah, it kind of looks like a, a rhino, you know, like, go, go, go tomorrow in Oregon. Uh, good luck from the squirrel. I think this one was, this was eager or one of the ones with little like white spots that I haven't named, but I've been like trying to figure out a name for. Yeah. Um, anything else? Yes, it, I, I, if, I think the funds for the 10% penalty get taken out of the retirement account. That's kind of, not my, my dad has withdrawn funds and he said that's kind of how it works. So I hope that is how it works out. Um, yes, but I trust him. Kind of thing. So yeah, I, you know, I've been fortunate. I live with my parents <laughs> currently. Um, and I've been fortunate that they are both retired and my dad has gone through the process of both, I think, with and without a penalty withdrawing funds from the retirement account. So he knows a little bit about how it works. So I was um, happy to have him as a resource uh, through this process. So there's a little bit about that. And happy Wednesday, 18 October 2023 as of filming this. And happy day and time of viewing whenever you're viewing this. And happy place of viewing this wherever you're viewing this from.